So I come into work and uh, my boss pulls me into the office and he's like, hey, can you sit down for a second? I was like, <sighs> I was like, I'll stand. What's going on? He's like, well, I'm, I have to place you on administrative leave because, um, you know, um, your drawer was short $30 and then two days later it was over $10. And I was like, okay. He's like, so we have to give, HR has to, um, you know, like review the footage of the videotape and decide what to do and, you know, blah, 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 blah. And I said, all right, when are they going to let me know? And he goes, oh, within 10 days. I said, well, I'll go clean out my locker. And, um, you know, like I said to him, just to paint, just to paint the picture, um, nobody pays with cash. You know what I mean? Nobody pays with cash. So it's not like as busy as we are, I'm dealing with cash, 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 cash. You know what I mean? Like I might get a purchase for $200 with cash. I might get, I probably, let's say out of 100 customers, maybe 15 of them, 15% say, 20% pay with cash so it's not like we're fucking handling cash and handling cash and so it's like you know I've never been short as a cashier in my life I know exactly what's going on the the one dude who thinks um who thinks he made it in life because he's a supervisor at a hardware store um because I don't bow down to him and let him talk to me any any type of way that he feels like it or whatever you know is you know manipulating the cash somehow i mean and uh you know overall i know you know i'll probably lose my job but i'll be vindicated at some other time and it's not really my it's not really my um job to pay him back or whatever i mean what am i gonna do punch him in the face and get arrested i mean he's not a he's not a, a you know like i'm not gonna get arrested and get an assault charge on top of losing my job you know what I mean but I am gonna have some words with him after we uh, part company and um, they're not gonna be um, Christian but I'm not gonna threaten him or anything but I'm just gonna let him know you know what you know he's, he's just a, he's you know whatever he's just ridiculous he has you know, I don't even I don't, I don't even want to say anything too bad about the guy. He's just a loser. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, just leave it at that. You know what I mean? The guy is just a, a total loser at life. You know what I mean? So I'll move on and find something else. I haven't liked what I've been doing for a while. God has always opened doors for me. I'm not. Can you wait a minute? <laughs> God has always opened doors for me, and I'm just like... You know, like, it's just the silliness of the whole thing. Like, you're putting me on administrative leave. I'm fucking 45 years old. How crazy. I mean, you can obviously tell I'm above average fucking common sense. I can operate a cash register and a computer and a telephone and everything else at the same time that we're doing all of this stuff and sign people up for stuff. And what, it's just so silly. Like, you know, like, it would be like, even if a person at like if you put a eighth grader in there or a seventh grader they could do the job do you know what i mean so it's like it's just insanity so i'm like whatever you know things end badly because they have to end or they would never end so i'm just like whatever however you want to do it god is fine with me you know i was riding my bike home and i was just like i, I kind of just felt like you know i'm not panicking i'm just kind of like relieved by the whole thing because I've just been tired of the whole situation of the toxic bullshit and the passive because this is what dudes do to me because they can't do anything to me physically people have done this to me my whole entire life you know what I mean like you know it's like somebody slicing your tires you know what I mean like because they can't do anything to you physically this is how somebody that can't um you know like work with people or you know somebody that's just you know tries to bully people and then he can't bully you so they do something different you know they 
you know, they start a rumor or tell the teacher or something or put something in your locker or just, you know, just stupid stuff. So I'm just like, whatever, this is so immature. You guys can do whatever you want. You know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm at peace with it. You guys have a good time. God obviously has other plans for me. So you guys have a, a good day.